So here at Four Flax Farm, we are a diversified farming operation. We have just over 31 acres total here. So agroforestry is part of our operation. And in that agroforestry, we do maple syrup production. Um, we cultivate and fruit um, shiitake mushrooms. We also have um, our chickens, our laying flock that we have here, about 35 laying hens. Um, and then we have here in the high tunnel, um, it's a 30 by 72, so a little over 2,100 square feet that we produce in hopefully four seasons. We started Four Flags Farm because it offers us um, the ability to live the lifestyle that we want to live here, um, to be wonderful stewards of our land and cultivate great things for our community members to enjoy. So I've always wanted to work for myself. Um, I think there's there's definitely something to be said about um, you know being your own boss and making your own hours. So that's always kind of the lifestyle that we've we've wanted to pursue. Armand and I both grew up in Indiana. Um, after college, we we got a chance to to travel for for my job, and uh, it kind of gave us a perspective on where we came from uh, and what we missed about it. Um, so after a few years of, of working uh, for a corporation, we came back to Indiana, um, both for the beautiful scenery and also to be close to family. There's a couple of things that make Four Flags Farm different from other farms. Um, number one, we're both a, a woman-owned and veteran-known uh, farm. Uh, additionally, we're a diversified farm, which means we don't just grow one crop. We diversify into other things like uh, maple syrup and honey, uh, chicken eggs, produce, uh, mushrooms, all kinds of different things. So resiliency is very important in, uh, in this business. Uh, as a farmer, whenever setbacks happen, and they're gonna happen, uh, you have to be able to, to bounce back and say, okay, what can I do after this? If someone was to be a, want to become a beginning farmer, uh, the first thing I'd say is you have to find your motivation. You have to come up with a plan. And that comes from uh, mentoring with other farmers, doing your own research, and uh, going back every time there's adversity, you have to remember what your motivation is, and that'll drive you through. So receiving the award um, was very impactful as far as um, us seeing the fruits literally of our labor coming to fruition and having people um, be more aware of what we're doing and what all of these other businesses are doing as well and the impact that you know, more Hoosiers could have by shopping with their local whomever business owner and supporting you know, our local economy is, is huge for us, but also for our business, for our community, for the state.